Welcome to day three of Mama Zen. 21 days to inner calm and empowered parenting. I'm so glad you're here. Today, we're focusing on a topic that many of us struggle with, perfection. It's easy to get caught up in the idea that we need to be perfect parents, constantly striving to meet an impossible standard. But the truth is, parenting isn't about being flawless. It's about being present, being loving, and showing up with care, even when things don't go exactly as planned. There's this silent pressure many of us carry, whether it's from social media, the expectations of others, or even our own inner critic, to be the perfect parent, to always have the right answers, to keep everything running smoothly, to never make mistakes. But that kind of thinking is exhausting. It keeps us in a constant cycle of stress and self-doubt, always feeling like we're falling short. The truth is, perfection doesn't exist, especially in parenting. Each day is filled with moments of unpredictability, and expecting ourselves to handle everything flawlessly only sets us up for frustration. What matters far more than perfection is presence, being there for your child in the messy, unpolished moments, offering love and care even when things don't go as planned. When we let go of the need to be perfect, we allow ourselves to be more authentic, more human, and more connected to our children. This affirmation, I release the need for perfection, is a way to remind yourself that it's okay to be imperfect. Your child doesn't need you to be perfect. They just need you to be there, to love them, and to do your best. By letting go of perfectionism, you give yourself the freedom to parent with more peace and joy. You allow yourself to embrace the beauty of your unique journey, knowing that the effort you're putting in is enough. So today, as you move through your day, take a deep breath and release the pressure to do everything perfectly. Instead, focus on showing up with love, patience, and authenticity. That's what your child needs most. Let's begin with today's Mind Power session, where we'll let go of the need for perfection and embrace the joy of simply being present in our parenting. Beginning with eyes closed. And as you take that deep breath in, open up the lungs and allow the stomach to expand out, breathing deep. Hold it for a few moments. Then out through the mouth, exhaling out any tension, any stress. Anything that doesn't serve you, all of those negative emotions are not a natural part of you. You don't need them, you don't want them, and so you let them go. You have the ability to create your own motherhood experience the way you choose. Just breathing in another deep breath and really deep allow the stomach and lungs to expand out. And then it's healing out very, very slowly. Letting go of any tension, any stress, any guilt, anything that doesn't serve you. You are an amazing mom. And you have the ability to create an amazing experience for you and your family. And with one more deep cleansing breath in, breathe in calmness, peace, patience. And then exhale out, breathe out any tension, any guilt, any of those emotions that don't serve you, just letting them go. And drifting down deeper and deeper now at five, four, three, two, one, and zero. Repeat the following words silently but strongly in your mind after me. I release the need for perfection. I release the need for perfection. I release the need for perfection. I am enough. Coming up now at one, two, three, four, five, eyes open, wide awake. You don't have to do it all perfectly. 
just do it with love. For deeper support on releasing perfectionism and building self-compassion, explore the Mama Zen app, where you'll find sessions designed to help you feel empowered and grounded as a parent. You're doing an amazing job, and sometimes that's more than enough. Thank you for joining me today, and I look forward to seeing you tomorrow for day four, where we'll work with the affirmation. I'm grateful for the time I spend with my kids. It's a beautiful reminder to cherish the moments we share with our children, no matter how small. See you then.